I'm Victor Sotlare from Adams Database. At Adams Database, we do asset data management services. In short, we register serial numbers of electronics or assets for the purpose of helping um, store the data for our clients so that whenever they need this information, they can have it instantly from our database. The idea behind Adams Database was to bring a sense of accountability, especially in Africa. Was the idea is to use technology to mold society, especially when it comes to the issue of crime. So we're using our technology to deter uh, criminals from stealing or making away with our electronics. So with this technology here, uh, once we have registered your asset, it will prove beyond reasonable doubt that it belongs to you. Not like, uh, not like the situation right now, whereby we only own our assets by possession, which means the first person to lay their hands on that asset is the owner. So we are keeping the asset information so that we can verify or whoever wants to know can verify who it truly belongs to. What we are trying to add, the value that we are trying to add to our communities or our societies is to let them know the value of their assets. Well, this is the wealth, these assets are the wealth of Botswana, of all Botswana. So by registering this or reminding them to register their assets, we are trying to put it in the back of their heads that this is valuable to you. So whenever they buy or they have anything which is valuable, they have to know that it has to be, they, this, there should be a sense of accountability. And Adams bridges that gap. So whatever they have, they have to register it. By so doing, it's like some sort of insurance. Technology is no longer like that. We know others use it for maybe social media or stuff, but there are others who are using it to change the world. Yeah. And a lot of people who are leading our industries, they are wholly dependent on technology. We are no longer using papers anymore. These are our papers. So we are just trying to instill in the minds of Botswana that these things are very important. They are here to stay and they are here to change our lives for the better, especially in Africa. So we have to take them seriously. Right now, Adam's database is based at Botswana Innovation Hub. That's where we are pre-incubated. That's where we are housed. And we are using their facilities. They are, um, they've given us uh, the resources that we need, more especially uh, the working space. If uh, to all those uh, entrepreneurs or innovators who are maybe working in their own space or they're working in silos, my word to them is just maybe to encourage them to come to Botswana Innovation Hub. Botswana Innovation Hub was created for the sole mandate of grooming or bringing that atmosphere for innovators.